The ultimate goal of the city council is to ensure the historic preservation of this iconic, you know, theater. That's the end goal. Um, beyond the appraisal, we'll see what um, are our options to ensure that that happens. We haven't entered the facility, so this will allow us to um, evaluate and ensure that it is being preserved. Once the appraisal is done, the council will get an opportunity to weigh in as terms of what, how, what we want to do. Was this done, I mean, it wasn't done through a vote by the city council, was it, or was this by the administration? Direction, person? direction by city council and administration. Anybody who knows the basics of this, it was preserved in 89 with my mother, 1989, and worked with the board to do it. They put in a couple million dollars to make it historic again. Ronald Reagan signed it in. That was what we did. And why do they need to come in and do uh, an evaluation? First, there already is an appraisal done on it. So um, they could use those or whatever, but it, for what purpose? No one cared when the church was here before. Nobody cared uh, other people offering on this place and different times it's been for sale and things like that. It's only now for some reason I wish we could have that discussion and really bring to light what's really going on. Oh, if it wasn't, le if it's legal, absolutely not. Why would I give them permission to do that? I don't see that they're any friends of mine, you know, so far. I don't see that Soria or Mega, they've not reached out to me to try to deal with any of these issues at all. And so, absolutely not. But if it's, le it's law, then we have to do that, you know. To me, it's obvious, just a stall technique. I feel they see the end of the road with our tenant and not sure what to do. I heard protesters were kind of challenging her on issues, and so I think she's got to do something and show she's got to do something, and this is an option that she has. Again, just because things have been stalled don't mean they're stopped, you know, so uh, no, I wouldn't consider any other offers right now until we finalize what we've started. It's pretty obvious that we're you know, being, I'd almost say discriminated, you know, as, as far as Christians, you know what I mean, right here. It's obvious it's just because of the church to me. The church is a great uh, um, asset to be here among the mix of it all. I think it does nothing but benefit. Matter of fact, I'm working with some of the other businesses that are supportive of it, and we're going to go around and kind of get our coalition together to show the support for it. It's just hard to go through the legal battle and to fire up the theater again and do all the shows and do this thing. But I guess. That's what's called for now is to um, show the public what really is going on.